doesn't get better now can i still believe even though we said we're taking it slow we'll see where it goes i already know if you're asking that you're the one for me you're the one for me babe Hey guys, so this is a really weird day. I've been busy. We went, me and Daddy, I went to breakfast this morning, and then I got to the salon. Busy until like, and we went early this morning, but um, it's like four now. So busy all morning at the salon, but now I have a couple hours to myself. Usually I work late on Tuesdays and Thursdays, but this Tuesday I happened to not be busy this afternoon. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna take advantage of this, and I'm gonna get started on our closets. Cleaning out closets, organizing closets, getting out summer stuff, putting winter clothes in, and fall clothes, and just getting out all our small clothes, mine and Joel's clothes that we don't wear anymore, and the girls' stuff they've grown out of, and, but one bummer is I can't find Kinsley's old clothes size 2T, and I don't know, I know I have them in a bin somewhere, I cannot find them, they're not in our attic, they're not out in our building, so I don't know, and that's about the time that we moved here. We moved here when Kinsley was two. So I'm thinking, thinking those clothes could have gotten um, lost somewhere in the move when we moved long ago. But I have found two bins of three T clothes. So and she already has some two T things in her closets and stuff. So maybe we can slide by. And I mean, but she's growing so fast, she could probably be in three T. So if anything, she may just be wearing some bigger clothes. If we need to because I'm not like I'm not even gonna go buy all these clothes first she's gonna grow out on them so quick and but that's why I love having girls because they like know that whatever I buy Kinsley now that it's gonna get used twice that Kinsley Claire blah can't talk that Claire will be able to wear Kinsley's clothes now when she grows out of it so that's super nice that I get to get at least two uses out of the clothes that I buy the girls that I buy them a lot of clothes so that's why it's really nice and thankful that I have two girls and I love having two girls but, I mean, we'd really like to have a boy, but it's so up in the air. Like, we have no idea this. I've been wanting to talk to you guys about this. But, like, if we have another one, I mean, we'd need a bigger house. This house. Hey, guys. So, my battery died on my camera here. And I don't have the other batteries for it. And the small camera, because I'm still trying to get my new camera fixed. And it should be in soon, I hope. I'm really excited to get it back. Batteries, I took those when we went to the, um... Went to the orchard, the or the orchard, whatever, sky top this weekend. So the other batteries are in the they're in the book bag that Claire usually takes with her and Molly's wants some loving. So um I really like this camera because I can see myself in it and it's really cool. But it's really big to vlog on. But anyways, I'm just it's just me home right now, so it doesn't matter. So I was saying about because if we have another one because I know you guys y'all ask all the time like every vlog I think in the comments there's like when are you gonna have a boy or when are you gonna have another one? First off you don't know if it's gonna be a boy so we could end up having three girls which would be totally found me I love girls and Molly because we really want some loving. But the thing is with growing your family is if you have a bigger family they need a bigger house they need a bigger car and it's just like oh my gosh are we gonna be able to do this? So, I don't know. We're up in the air. We don't know what we're doing. We, um, so, yeah. I think I'm just trying to talk to you guys because I don't want to have to go, um, do these closets. But I need to get to them. I need to get started. And I'm taking off tomorrow morning to get the closets finished. Because I just want to get this done. I don't want to, like, drag it out forever and just have clothes everywhere. But I know I've been needing to go through all of their clothes and everything. My last one. But, yeah, we don't know. Like, we want to do fun stuff with the girls, vacations, and, like, it's just like you start over. But then, I feel, I really feel like if we didn't try, then I would always, like, regret not trying. Because you never know. Like, but really, like, we're not, like, trying, but we're not not trying. Like, we're not trying to, like, prevent anything, really. I mean, we're trying to not really have another one right now. And right now, maybe too soon, because we want to... I mean, I don't, I really liked how the girls were kind of spread out, so really another year would be like whenever as far apart as they are, because they're almost like four years apart, but right now they'd be like three years apart. Then I don't think I want them to, I'd rather have another one now or in a year, 
within this year or if not then I feel like I would rather just not and just be our little family of four but we love our I just love that over there. so I mean we just love our little family and it just would be easier I guess to not have to change everything but because our lives would just totally change if we have another one I feel like we'd get be even busier and I already want Kinsley to be in dance and gymnastics now because I really want her to do dance but then I don't want to switch her out of gymnastics so she's probably going to end up doing dance and gymnastics and then Claire's getting older and I really want her to be in something and they're going to just keep us so busy with activities and school and, and we're really like on the go all the time so to add another baby in the mix would be like craziness because we're already so like go 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 we gotta do this this weekend we gotta do that we gotta go here we gotta go there like we have all these plans halloween next couple weeks is gonna be crazy we've got costume parties we got the halloween trick-or-treating near the salon downtown we gotta go to zoo in the zoo we're going trunk or treat and trick or treating on halloween it's just we just have a busy life and so to add another one in the mix would be crazy. <laughs> so we're already trying to figure out what plans we want to do this weekend. Anyway, so I'm going to get to my clothes. So these are my bins that are like seasonal stuff that I'm switching in and out. Pretty much, that's pretty much ours, mine and Joel bins. Um, this is some of the 3T stuff that I was starting to look through to see. Like, I can't believe I can't find the 2T stuff. Both of the girls have their own bins of seasonal stuff. So anyways, I need to get started. It's going to be a long process. I've got to get it done. Usually, October and April is when I normally go through clothes, clean out closets, and like reorganize stuff and get out small stuff, all that. And so, anyways, okay, I'm going to get busy now. I think I'm going to start in Kinsley's room. I think hers is my favorite to do because... Her clothes are getting to be like the teenager, not teenager, teenager clothes, whatever you want to say. Like, they're so, I just love her clothes. Even just to clean up, this is a pile of stuff that's clean that I need to organize and put in her drawers and stuff. But you guys can see her closet is just a mess. Gotta organize this stuff. Yep, I'm just gonna get to organize it. I'm gonna take everything out and redo everything. I might see you guys, I might not. And I mean, the process is pretty much the same. So, yeah, we'll see. Hey guys, so I now went through most of Kinsley's stuff. I think I'm pretty much finished up in here. So first off, I started, like, I just went through everything. I started in her closet, got out all of her small stuff, and switched it. I went through her closet, all her shorts, t-shirts, pajamas, leotards, shoes, everything. And got out all the small stuff. Then I got out her box. She had two bins. These two bins had winter stuff in it that I think she could still wear um, from last winter. So I got all that stuff out and organized it. And then this is her bin of things that I got out that she can still wear like next summer. So I just had bought this, but it's a little big and, you know, and then these shorts and things like that that she can wear next summer and like I think she'll still be able to wear those sandals and just things that she can wear next summer but they were summer clothes so that's all in there now I have an empty bin but these are clothes that are going to go to Claire Bear that were too small for Kenzo and I'll probably end up putting them in that bin and then and I'll label it like 4T 5T stuff that she can wear for when she gets older so I still can't believe I can't find the 2T stuff though for Claire for this season that I need to get out but anyway it's what the closet looks like these are all of her play dresses these clothes from this one here over this is stuff that I want her to wear soon like I just really want her to wear that before I give it away put it away whatever um and then I put all her long sleeve stuff back here because we don't really need the long sleeves yet and then I go ahead and make like outfits like, I put, like, shirts and pants together, so it's really easy to grab in the morning. Um, so, all these are per pants and shirts that she can wear right now. So, in between these two. So, we don't go by the size now, but I still use these <laughs> to, like, separate. And then, um, those are some newer clothes and stuff that she needs to grow into. I have all these hangers empty. And then, this is a bin of stuff that she's grown out of. I always keep a bin 
stuff that she's grown out of that way whenever I try something on it if it's too small then I just throw it in there and then I know it's too small so all of that will go to Claire Bear eventually too. I need to get that out probably it's pretty much full so now I'm going to start in Claire's room. I have a bag here that we're going to give to our friend Adeline of stuff that Kinsley's grown out of but I'm not going to keep for Claire and some things I think she would like so yeah. Okay so now I'm in Claire's closet and now I'm going to go through this stuff and see how this one's labeled seasonal summer winter clothes um claire's isn't going to be too bad she pretty much has grown because i still have hers in order in size so these are all too small and so i'm pretty much going to go through those and give away or keep whatever i want to and then uh and then these are still by size so pretty much we'll just be taking out the winter stuff here claire's won't take too long and then i'll be starting on mine and joel's and that's probably going to take the longest so well kids took a pretty good while so and then try to figure out if I need to get out 3G stuff for Claire or just wear whatever she's got out already so yeah I think daddy was calling me Dad! Dad! how you doing what you doing baby girls I got that. you got that reading her book guys <laughs> so now going through actually Claire I've started going through her drawers first I forgot about having to go through those so this is a pile of 18 month stuff and this is some two teeth th summer things she could probably still wear she's not looking like she has a lot of clothes since I don't have in the two teeth stuff so but still a working working Today has been a really, really, really busy day. I've been busy at the salon all day, and then Daddy busy? was busy. He adjusted busy? all day. The doctor called out. So it's been real busy. Right, We're both really busy. So this doctor over here filled in. But they're both coloring. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible posture right now. Look at I'm so tired. I think I'm going to go take a shower and go to bed. Oh, I got one. That's what oh, I feel oh, like. Oh, ask Kinsley if you can. I don't even know if oh, I'll yeah. edit tonight because yeah, I'm so tired. And yeah, just need a break. Yeah, Lots of Halloween festivities coming up. Stay tuned. <laughs>